Welcome to TSL 3 Minute English. Hi, this is Amrita, your ESL teacher. So today, as usual, I'm here with some more expressions. So do you want to speak English like a native English speaker? So watch me, all right? That's great. So have you just heard that I said, that's great? So today we are going to learn some expressions that native English speakers often use to say that's great. Instead of just saying that's great, that's great, we can use some other expressions to make our speech sound like more natural, vibrant and tasty. So let's start speaking tasty English. Okay, superb. You can just say superb. Instead of saying that's great, you can use this expression superb. Repeat up to me. Superb. 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 Expression number two. You can use that's amazing. That's amazing. That's amazing. Also, you can say amazing. 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 Expression number three. That's the way. That's the way. So someone just gave you um, a good news. Someone just said he or she did something very great. A good job, accomplished something. Then you can say that's the way. That's the way. That's the way. Or you can say that's first class work. That's first class work. That's first class work. So instead of just saying it's great, you can use these expressions. Hello everyone, Assalamu Alaikum. Welcome to TESOL Bangladesh. I hope you all are just doing great. This is Amrita here, your ESL teacher. I'm Vice Principal of Bangladesh Online School. Also, I'm coordinating two courses. One is Creative Writing and Grammar, and another one is English for Kids and Moms. Today's session is specially for moms because most of our mothers in Bangladesh don't know how to speak in English with their children. And that is why they cannot raise their children um, smartly and they are not so confident. So let's become confident mother, right? So today we are going to learn some beautiful expressions to start our day afresh with our children. So let's learn together, okay? But you will have to repeat after me. I'm going to repeat so that you can listen to me carefully, you can get the input carefully, and then you will have to practice after me, you will have to repeat after me. It will be really helpful for you to keep it in your memory, but Remember one thing, you always have to practice, not just during this session, not just during watching me. After this video, you are going to use it with your child. Don't be shy, okay? You are a smart mom and you are raising a smart kid. Just think about it. All right then. So let's learn together. Good morning, dear. Good morning, my child. You can just start like a very conventional way, like good morning, dear, or good morning, dear child, or good morning, child. But there are some other expressions that we can use. All right, then let's learn and repeat after me. Wake up, child. Wake up, dear. You are getting late. Wake up, child. Wake up, dear. Or wake up, little sunshine. So you can use any name, um, any kind of uh, word, okay, that expresses affection, like my bundle of joy, or little pea, or beautiful doll, bright star. So these are the words that you can use. Wake up, dear. Wake up, my child. You are getting late. Um, if uh, your child is getting late for school, then you can use this expression. Wake up, child. You are getting late. Okay, now let's repeat. 
Wake up, child. You are getting late. Wake up, child. You are getting late. Wake up, child. You are getting late. All right. I hope you already repeated three times. Great. Let's learn another expression. Get up, sweetheart. It's a happy morning. Get up, sweetheart. It's a happy morning. Okay? Repeat after me. Get up, sweetheart. It's a happy morning. All right? Get up, sweetheart. It's a happy morning. Get up, sweetheart. It's a happy morning. You repeat it? Mm -hmm. All right. Good. Or there's another expression that's a little bit rhythmic and it's really good. Okay? Wakey, wakey, sleepy birdie. Wakey, wakey, sleepy birdie. Okay? Wakey, wakey, sleepy birdie. All right then, repeat after me. I'm repeating thrice. Okay? Wakey, wakey, sleepy birdie. Wakey, wakey, sleepy birdie. Wakey, wakey, sleepy birdie. Okay. So besides uh, these greetings, morning wishes, you can also ask your child, I hope you slept well. I hope you slept well. See, I'm repeating, okay? Uh, for you to understand me clearly, you will have to repeat after me, okay? It will uh, give you a good practice. I hope you slept well. I hope you slept well. I hope you slept well. Great. So these are the expressions and there are more expressions that you can learn when you are going to enroll in our um, English for Kids and Mom classes. Then you will be able to learn with us and practice with your children. All the best. Okay, dear moms, take care. Bye-bye.